everyone in Hawaii has their opinion on which island is their favorite. For many, it is Kauai. This garden isle is rich in awesome beauty that you have to see and feel for yourself in person. Just taking a short, pleasant drive around the island will make the entire trip worthwhile. The more you see of Kauai, the more you'll ask yourself, why don't I find more excuses to do this more often? In fact, if you need to borrow an excuse to get yourself to Kauai, use this one. It's time to go fishing up at the Kokei Reservoir to enjoy trout season. Let's see if the bite is on. Hey Ken, hey Ken, what you using for bait? Uh, secret dough bait and he's on. How's that for Kauai Rainbow Trout? How's it, Miles? How's it, brother Ben? Good to meet you. Good to meet you, too. Uh, my good buddy Ken Nishioka says that you're the guy that made that secret bait. <laughs> I try. How long have you been fishing up here? Uh, I would say with my kids, 20 years. Uh, before then, back in the 70s with the Boy Scouts. Uh-huh. This is your backyard, then? I would say so, yeah. My backyard. The um, trout, good size, huh? They're good size. Um, it's part of, I would say, some is almost three years old, two years old. Last year's stocks, uh, which came from the uh, the nursery uh, back in Oahu, I would say they're a half a pound, one pound. But the rule of thumb is a pound a year. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so if you have. You're gonna catch a lot of fish when you come up here to, to go for the trout, you yes. know, when, it, when it's in season yes. and when it's happening. So you can only eat one fish at the end of the day. What do you do with the rest? Well, I normally would smoke it and uh, give it away. I just had take out this morning on a fresh batch uh, smoke trout. Did he tell you about my smoke trout? Oh. Sam Choi loves them. If you were wondering, the secret to our trout fishing success is in the bait. And what we're using is irresistible to these fish. It's a fat boy. <laughs> now that's a good sized Kauai rainbow trout. You know, Miles, when people talk behind your back, <laughs> you know, they're talking about how good you are catching trout also about your bait. I know it's a secret, Yeah. but how'd that come about? I mixed my bait for 20 years, but if you study what other people make, you can get ideas. Uh, when it comes to the nitty gritty, when the fish is not biting, that's where the observation of all the years would compile your own secrets. Everybody have their own secrets. But let's share, I'll show it on TV, this glitter. I call it my bling bling. <laughs> It kind of just enhances it more because you look at the power bait, they have different colors, you know, red, gold, green. So I said, what would enhance my secret though? So last year, I put the glitters. People would ask me, Miles, how, how you mix your bait? I said, I will mix for you, I will give you, but I won't tell you my secret. You know, and that's fair. The recipe is yours as a secret, but Thank fishing, you. sharing is, that's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. Yeah. Yeah.
you know, Miles, fishing for trout every year up here has been such a great family tradition. People look forward to it, you know, year after year. But just, you know, recently, of course, the financing for this has, you know, just kind of gone down the drain. So what are your hopes for this place? Well, my hopes is whoever is the next governor would bring back the, uh, the funding for the nursery in Oahu because every year, just the trout fishing, it generates the economy so well. Folks, a couple guys to say thank you for this great trip up to Koke, Ken Nishioka, Dan Birch, of course, even Miles. Folks, don't go away. A lot more of the fishing show is coming your way right after you catch this.